Get the worksheet used in this lesson, as well as hundreds of others, at mathcation.com. This video is about solving one-step equations. You can get the worksheet used in this video for free by clicking on the link in the description below. One-step equations are equations that you can solve in one step, hence the name one-step equations. Typically, when solving one-step equations, you will either use addition, subtraction, multiplication, or division. The trick in solving one-step equations is to keep the equation balanced. This means that whatever you do to one side, you also have to do to the other side. So think of the equal sign as sort of a divider represents two equal sides and that the two sides have to remain balanced. If you perform an operation on one side, you also have to do the same exact operation on the other side. So if you look at our example here, we have x plus 3 equals 4. We are trying to solve for x. We want to know what x is equal to. In order to solve for x, we have to undo this plus 3. So this plus 3 is in our way, and we have to get rid of it. In order to get rid of this plus 3, you have to undo it or do the opposite of plus 3. So in this case, the opposite of plus 3 is minus 3. In order to get rid of plus 3, we're going to do minus 3. The reason we're doing that is so the 3's on this side go away. Remember, our equal sign separates the equation into two sides that must remain equal. So whatever you do on one side, you also have to do to the other side of the equal sign. In this case, since we did minus 3 on this side, we also have to do minus 3 on the other side you now have 4 minus 3, which is 1. So we have 1 on this side. And then all that's left on our left side is x. So this plus 3 is now canceled because we did minus 3. And all that's left over here is x. And 4 minus 3 is 1, so our solution is x equals 1. I know that we're done simplifying when we have x equals a number on the other side of the equal sign. Let's do a couple practice problems on our one-step equations worksheet. The first problem we're going to complete for showing you how to solve one-step equations is problem one. This problem gives us x plus one equals four. Now we know that whatever we do to one side of the equation, we also have to do to the other. In this case, we have x minus one equals four. We have to do the opposite of minus one because we're trying to get x on this side by itself. So in order to get x by itself, we have to get rid of this minus 1. So the opposite of minus 1 is plus 1. We're going to do plus 1 here so that this minus 1 and this plus 1 cancel. And then whatever you do to one side of the equal sign, you also have to do to the other. So we're also going to do a plus 1 on this side. On the left side, all that's left is x. So now we have our x. We have our equal sign in the middle that we bring straight down. Finally, we're going to do 4 plus 1 to get our solution of 5. So the solution to this one-step equation is x equals 5. The next problem we're going to complete is number 2, which gives us 3x equals 21. Now, 3x is like saying 3 times x. So this is like saying 3 times x equals 21. The opposite of 3 times something, or opposite of multiplying something times 3, is to divide by 3. So we're going to divide this side by 3, so that 3 divided by 3 will cancel. So the 3's will cancel, and we're left with just x on this side. And then whatever you do to one side, you also have to do to the other. So we also have to divide this side by 3. And 21 divided by 3 is equal to 7. So our solution is x equals 7. The last problem we're going to complete on our one-step equations worksheet is number 7. This problem gives us x minus 8 equals 2. Now the opposite of minus 8 is plus 8. So we're trying to get rid of this minus 8 because we want x by itself on one side. So we're going to do plus 8 on this side. And we're also going to do plus 8 on the other side because whatever you do to one side, you also have to do to the other. So this minus 8 and this plus 8 cancel. They go away. And we're left with x equals and then 2 plus 8 on the other side, which is 10. So our solution 
to number 7 is x equals 10. I hope this video was helpful for teaching you solving one-step equations. If you found this video helpful, make sure you drop a like, subscribe to our channel, or check out our website for more premium math content. Thanks for watching.